What's up YouTube? What's going on? It's Cool Freak here and in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how to install Expose Framework in Marshmallow that is 6.0 Let's do this So before that you need some short of files to install uh, Expose Framework First of all you need to be rooted If you are not rooted this video is not for you So I will provide the link of each and every files in the description down below so go and check it let's start first you need is exposed installer that is this one like this I will provide the link in the description so in this ROM that is uh, marshmallow this is saying that exposed framework is not installed please download the latest zip from XG and flash it manually by recovery so I will provide the link you can go and download it and place it under your SD card or internal one so I have already downloaded the files for example I can show you this one expose version 79 SDK 23 armor 64 dot zip go back and shut down so again you need to go to the recovery by holding these three buttons at a time before installing a framework you should be rooted and you should have a perfect recovery for this I have the latest version of TWRP so select the zip so this is, here it is expose version 79 SDK 23 make sure you download the perfect file for your mobile wait until it flashes so it has successfully installed now reboot the system so it has been started let's see what happened to exposed okay so it says uh, exposed framework version 79 is activated so go back so you need to download some sort of softwares from here download go to downloads if you can download uh, these XUI modes and all I have previous videos go check in to my channel so right now you need to download gravity box for marshmallow hit it and download it For each and every installation of the software, you should have to reboot your system. So, for activating that, go to Expose Installer, go to Modules, and tick those software which you want to install. After installation, here it is saying that after ticking, you should have to reboot to see the changes. So, reboot the system once again. So, after rebooting, you can see the modules are successfully installed. You can directly jump into that. So there are many tweaks you can go through it you can play with any other tweaks so for example there are many tweaks that is uh, lock screen tweaks, data bar tweaks, navigation bar tweaks, pie control, display tweaks, phone tweaks, media tweaks, launcher, navigation application, screen recording etc stuffs are there so for example if I am choosing this uh, status bar tweaks so there are a bunch of options are here you can play with it you can change each and everything for each and everything you should have to reboot to see the changes so in this you can go to clock setting so if you want to uh, center the clock for example this one hit this so you can see here the clock is came into the middle on the center of the status bar so here is the option also to hide am or pm so go back so here you can see the battery setting also you can choose the style indicator of it like dash circle battery with percentage none dash circle with battery circle with battery percentage many more things for example I'm doing this percentage so you can see so there are many styles are there dash so you can see here also you can even add data monitoring traffic style here simple style you can change the position of it also like this uh, it, it can be aligned in any direction like left and right so choose this so here you can see so here is the signal cluster setting you can change it to 4G light after reboot you can see the changes over here this is just uh, notification draw style which way you want to customize it 
you can set the background also fill color or you can add custom images also over here you can add navigation bar tweaks here also you can see here uh, if you enable this setting after reboot it will be take changes so you can see here it is power tweaks so you can add power tweaks advanced reboot or menu options so you can customize these settings also allow reboot on lock screen require reboot confirmation screenshot screen recorder so there are bunch bunch of options will be over here if you add it there is recovery bootloader and reboot so there are many things you can play with it so there are many shortcut keys also home key menu key and back key they have different lots of functions you can enable it over there you can play with this gravity box marshmallow version so go back so here is the xui mode so i have full installation video for xui mode i will leave the link in the description down below go and check it how to install it and how to customize this xui mode so this is it guys thanks for watching and if you like this video then hit the like button Share this video with your friends. Hope you enjoyed this video. Spread the word, you cool freak. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.